Okay there, hey, hi, it's Matthew Rayfield here for another Matthew Rayfield update. What is Matthew Rayfield worldwide, the company, not the person, working on? Although the person's working on it too. Because I'm the only employee. It's Matthew Rayfield worldwide. <laughs> Alright, yeah, the game. Here's the game, man. Whoa, it's pink now. Ah, but is it always pink? No, it's not. Once you enter one of these buildings, the color immediately changes. Ooh, you like that transition? How it, ooh, ooh, it's good, right? Ooh, ooh, from green to the yellowish green, or from the, this is the green, from the pink to the yellowish green hue. So smooth, so glistening, so wonderful. Uh, other than that, there's not much too much uh, new here to the game. There's some technical changes that you really can't see, um, but yeah, the color changing is, is the new it's the new hot feature we got going on. As far as the storyline, as far as a name for this game, we're not there yet. I'm not there yet, but it's coming along. I'm really I'm excited with the the progress that's been made. I'm excited about the color changing. That was an idea that I had that I wanted to implement. Ooh, back to the white. And I'm out. Okay, that's the game. Cool. That's number one thing. Uh, don't mind this. Um, number two thing is... Uh, not that. Okay, this. This pattern. See that pattern? Wouldn't that pattern... Wouldn't that pattern make a good t-shirt? Funny you should say that. Because here is a mock-up of a t-shirt that I've ordered. And I like how it turned out. Now, you'll notice it's a repeating pattern, but the creatures are all slightly different. But do you notice anything about one of them? One of these creatures is wearing glasses. And that's just kind of a little something special for not really so much the wearer of the t-shirt, but everyone around the person wearing the t-shirt. Because a certain percentage of people will say, hey, I like that t-shirt. A certain percentage of people will say, hey, I like that t-shirt. Oh, but wait a second, is that one guy wearing glasses? I'd say that's about 10% of people will say that. And some percentage of people won't like the t-shirt at all. But that's life. So anyways, a prototype is coming in the mail and we'll see how the t-shirt works out. Okay, there's one more project that Matthew Refill Worldwide is working on, and that is Big Baller. Now, here you can see the Big Baller prototype. I finally finished the prototype. The purple is 3D printed parts, got a jar, got a tennis ball. Now you may be asking, what does Big Baller do? Unfortunately, I cannot yet reveal that, um, but I can tell you that today, this prototype was tested, and it didn't go super well. So some changes will need to be made, and uh, but but I'm I'm ready for that. I was ready for that uh, result from the prototype testing, and I've got some ideas, uh, and you might hear more about Big Baller in the future. It may actually not be called Big Baller in the future because the ball might be gone. Mm. Think on that one. Wow. That's something to think about. Um, otherwise, what else? You know what? Not too much else. Uh, oh, here's the thing. No, I don't want to open that. Okay. So, otherwise, I've been working on a video. See this guy? See this character? Whoop. All right. So, that was drawn by my 3D printer, actually. And I'm working on a video about how you, too, can use a 3D printer to draw two-dimensional stuff with. It's kind of like using a 3D printer as a 2D printer. But it's not a printer, if you catch my drift. Because it's, you really, you're taking a marker and you just stick it on the printer and it does kind of that business. Uh, that's it, that's all I got for you. That's the world of Matthew Reefield Worldwide. And uh, I, hope, uh, I hope you enjoyed it. And, um,